If there's one golf kid who's on his way to step into his father's shoes, it has to be Charlie Woods. Woods Jr. has gotten quite the attention in the past few years, probably because of how similar he is to his father. But hey, this father-son duo doesn't just share their love for golf, they're also both equally competitive. And you know what that means, right? Yep, lots of heated arguments on the field. In this video, we'll be telling you about an exclusive interview where Charlie Woods opened up about his father, Tiger Woods. So let's jump right into it. First up, let's talk about the father-son golf duo. Everyone in the golf world already knows about Tiger, but what you may not know is that the legendary golfer's love for the game has been passed down to his son. Charlie. Tiger introduced Charlie to the game of golf at a very young age. They've been playing together at various golf courses, and Tiger even brought his son along to some of his big tournaments. But hey, Charlie isn't just here to watch. In fact, the father-son duo has already played together in several tournaments. They were last seen at the PNC Championship where they managed to secure a second place finish, but more on that in just a minute. In his interviews, Tiger said that he sees a lot of himself in Charlie when he was at that age. He's also spoken about his son's impressive progress and how proud he is of him. In fact, Tiger even mentioned that he enjoys playing golf with his son and that it's a great way for them to bond. And of course, there's nothing better than seeing golf legends playing with their young sons, right? Tiger also says that he wants Charlie to enjoy playing golf, even if it means he doesn't become a professional player. But from the looks of it, Charlie is already on his way to the majors. At such a young age, he's super motivated to be on the golf course and give it his best shot. And on that topic, let's fill you in on the PNC Championship. Tiger and Charlie with both seen donning their traditional red at the PNC Championship in Orlando. They seem pretty fired up to finally win a tournament together. After all, those red leather Willie Park belts would have looked pretty good on them. Unfortunately, it just wasn't meant to be. Team Woods started Sunday just two shots out of the lead, so things looked pretty promising at that point. Then they shot 7 under 65 and ended up tying for 8th at 20 under 124. The winning team, VJ and Cass Singh, finished 6 shots better at 26 under 118. But even if they didn't take the win, they did walk away with tons of new father son memories. They shared some laughs, quality learning time, and even some heated arguments. And most importantly, Charlie got to learn that when it comes to golf, you lose a lot more than you win. But hey, let's give the 13-year-old and his father a break. They were both injured, with Tiger still recovering from his car crash last year and Charlie dealing with quite an iffy left ankle. We could see both of them limping as they walked through the field. In fact, they often shared a cart before teaming up to shoot that impressive 13 under 59 that brought them closer to the lead. But despite their great performance, they were both clearly struggling with their injuries. At one point, Charlie even fell to the ground in pain after hitting a drive. In the post-game interview, he admitted that on some shots, his ankle hurt a lot. But hey, the young golfer knows exactly how to power through, just like his dad. He even said that walking was tough, but it was all right. It wasn't all that bad. If you're wondering what happened to Charlie's ankle, then let's tell you what Tiger thinks about it growing pains. A week before the game, Tiger spoke to the press and said that there is a huge difference between pain and an injury, and this one's just pain. He also added that if you're injured, you're not gonna play. But if it's just a little bit of pain and it's time for a game, then we just gotta go out there and suck it up together. Now that's the kind of father-son synchronization we're rooting for. Interestingly, Tiger and Charlie were playing like the perfect yin and yang at the PNC. Charlie had left foot pain and Tiger had right foot injury. So in total, they had two good feet and they made the best use of them. After the game, Charlie admitted that his father mostly carried him around throughout the match. But more than anything else, this was a testament to how well Tiger is performing despite his surgically repaired right leg. And if we recall correctly, then the PNC was just a few weeks after Tiger was forced to withdraw from the Hero World Challenge because of the painful plantar fasciitis in his foot. But of course, in Charlie's eyes, the PNC was a whole other experience. He He's heard the iconic stories about winning the US Open on a broken leg. He attended the 2019 Masters himself, and in the past two years, he's seen his father make an absolutely miraculous comeback. Now, after the PNC, he understands where all that perseverance came from. In a statement to the press, Charlie said he's found more respect for his father after getting a very minor injury himself. In fact, he said it's not even an injury, it's just a little hurt. But now, after playing through all that pain, Charlie understands what his 
his father was going through and said that it's cool to see how he's gotten to where he is now despite everything he's been through. And then after the game, Charlie also opened up about something personal. During his first ever TV interview, Charlie gave us an exclusive insight into his on-course relationship with his father. In fact, he admitted that it gets heated when the father-son duo have different opinions. Woods Jr. also gave us a glimpse into his competitive personality when he said that he was willing to argue with his father. The 13-year-old was confident enough to say, I push him as much as I possibly can. Once he pushes back, I know I can push a little bit more and then I'm done. Then I know it's going to get heated. On that note, the proud father also admitted that the pair did get heated at the PNC when they pulled back the field from the slow start. He said that even though it was a great day, the duo did get a little heated there in the early to middle part of the round on Saturday. The main disagreement between the father and son came at the 13th hole. That's when Tiger hit what we know as the shot of the day, as the ball nestled into the bushes. Even though he chipped the ball back on the green, yards from the pin, he did admit later that he had a little argument with his son before it. Apparently, Charlie wanted to play his shot, but he also wanted his father to hit a little five wood off the tee. Of course, Tiger ended up overruling, just like any other father would overrule. He said he didn't mind the oomph, but there's a limit to how much input Woods Sr. would take from his son. If he pushes too much, then the father knows where to draw the line. Despite the heated arguments, Charlie was pretty proud of how well his father played. As the only son in the family, Charlie has seen his father go through a lot. He's seen him win championships, lose them, and then even face horrific injuries like the car crash last year. At this point, he knows that his father is a fighter not a quitter. After the PNC Championship, Charlie told the press that he felt like he already knew what his father was capable of, but then he saw his performance at the PNC and that kind of shocked him. In fact, Charlie thought that this was his father's best performance in quite a while. In response, Tiger only gave a self-deprecating statement, which is pretty typical coming from a father figure. All he said was, I used to be good. So what's next for the Woods family? Even though a lot of people are talking about how Tiger's best days are behind him now, we're a still hoping to see a lot more of him in the future, especially with his son Charlie. Charlie is already showing a lot of promise as a professional golfer, and lots of people are looking forward to seeing him compete in the big game. He already participated in several junior tournaments and managed to win some of them too. Recently, Charlie participated in the US Kids Golf South Florida Championship and secured a victory. It was a proud moment for his father and a testament to Charlie's hard work and dedication to golf. In fact, Tiger even said that he'd love to play golf in the same tournament as his son someday. Now that's a sight we'll be waiting for. But for now, that's a wrap on this video. What do you think about the super competitive Woods family? If Tiger and Charlie played against each other, who would win? Let us know in the comments below. Before you head out, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more awesome golf updates. See you in the next one.